11 months ago, I had a solar system fitted by Heatable on my east roof with 10 solar panels. Now the video and this question is gonna be, why are, am I doing an 11 month review and not a 12 month review? But trust me, it's well worth the surprise on the reason why. And second question, which this video will be answering right now, is, is getting solar panels worth buying in the years 2024, 2025? Now there's no longer a government feed-in tariff because you'll be surprised at the answer. Now, in a minute, we're gonna be talking to some experts about my solar panel system, not just from Heatable, but also from an independent estate agent to talk about the value and what happens to your house when getting solar panels. So make sure you stick around for that. But first, let me tell you what system I have. I have 10 panels on my east roof and they're REA bifacial panels with N-phase microinverters. It had a total install cost of £11,455. And that also included an Alpha ESS 10 kilowatt hour battery. Now, there's reviews and sort of talked about all the other systems that I've done all, so far up top, right? So go and check that out. But first, let's talk to Heatable on why we have N-phase panels and microinverters. Hi, my name's Ben. I'm one of the solar experts here at Heatable. Now, the system that Nick has on his property is one of our REA Fusion 2 systems, which has been combined with these N-phase microinverters. It's optimised for working in low light conditions, which hopefully has come good for Nick, given that he lives in the Peak District. Now, in our own test, we saw a 15% uplift when compared to a standard hybrid inverter with this system. So let's see how it's done for Nick. Now, this is one of the worst years for solar energy. In fact, if you look at solar forums, people are moaning about how dismal this summer is. And if you think about 2024 right now, it hasn't been a great summer. It's been pretty much awful. It's been raining a lot, cloudy a lot. It's not great for solar energy. So the data is actually over one of the worst periods of solar we've seen for quite some time, which is actually the perfect data set for looking at solar payback because things can only get better. Now, if you want to see my data set and live data from my solar panels, you can go to evnick.com forward slash solar. There's information there and links for Heatable for discounts if you order through Heatable and a discount for a battery only system if you don't want any panels. But let's look at my figures because from August 2023 to June 2024, 11 months of data, I generated just under 900 kilowatt hours of energy. I exported 353 kilowatt hours back to the national grid and my home used 3,170 kilowatt hours. I imported from the grid 2,722 kilowatts. Now, before I unveil what I've saved in total, let's explain some of the tricks that I've used to actually manipulate my data and get better payback from my solar system. Now, if you've followed my channel for a while, you'll probably know I'm an electric car owner. By the way, I do videos about electric cars, solar, battery reviews, EV charge reviews, all the time on this channel. So if you haven't already, go and click subscribe, click that notification bell, and you won't miss any extra videos I make, especially around some very interesting things I've got coming with Heatable very soon. But I have an EV, which means I can use a special tariff from Octopus Energy called Octopus Intelligent. Now, the rates on this have recently changed, but as of the day I'm making this video, they've dropped down to 7p off-peak, which means during off-peak hours, I can charge my electric car and my home storage battery at 7p. So I fill that up every single night at 7p. And why would I fill it up and let my excess solar go back to the grid rather than fill the battery up? Well, Octopus Energy pay 15p a kilowatt hour on Octopus Go Intelligent for that power going back to the grid. So I'm, I'm making a small profit on that electricity going back to the grid. So the more I export from the battery, the more money that my solar system will earn in payback. Now, this rate can change at any time and it is based on basically me working this out short term. So don't base your, this tariff lasting around forever. It might not, it might disappear. It might even get better, you might even better earn more money. But for the short term period, I can increase payback of my system using this inventive tariff from Octopus Energy. Now, based on the data so far and the data I've collected in export energy and the way I've been manipulating the tariffs, I've earned over 11 months, 930 pound savings on my solar system. Now, if we add in the missing July, because this is an 11 month review, not a 12 month review, we'll explain why soon. 
it means it's about a thousand pound a year in savings now you might work that out that that's about an 11 year payback based on what the system cost and a lot of people might think 11 year payback seems a great payback for solar system and then other people are moaning that 11 year payback on an investment for that kind of money is a poor payback and that is not because you're considering some major factors about not only has this been a bad year for solar but also what this expert says hi there it's nick from ashton's estate agents we had the pleasure today of reviewing Nick's house after his solar installation and we would estimate that the install has added around 5% to the property's value. Not only that, it's also made it a lot more sellable. Because the solar package that's been introduced will now bring the energy bills down, which is a huge plus point for potential purchasers, making overall an incredible upgrade to the home. By the way, 5% is way more than the total system cost. And that's also before you consider that I now would not live anywhere without solar panels on the roof, which is why we come to the next reason this data is over 11 months and not 12. Now, if your first guess was that I've moved, it's not that. The eagle-eyed of you already have spotted five panels here on my west roof. So I've got 10 on my east, five on my west, but that's not all. We've got some other panels somewhere else, and we'll explain this in a second. But first, let me tell you about the deal from Heatable. If you go to evnick.com forward slash Heatable, you can get £150 off your solar install when clicking that link or using code evnick150. But if you want a battery-only system, you can also get £75 off using evnick75 or going to evnick nick.com forward slash heatable forward slash battery we've also added two other panels somewhere else one on the south panel which will be interesting but also one to the north array so wait until you see that data now if you want to learn more about the solar system check out this playlist we've done here about solar and battery systems